my second morning here in Cologne and I have come to do what many other people living in the city are going to do this morning, come to one of the local neighborhood kiosks to pick myself up a coffee. Now, this is quite an idiosyncratic thing to Cologne as a city. These kiosks are in every neighborhood and they are supposedly the hubs of the neighborhood. I'm interested in what makes them more than just a place where you buy a newspaper, a croissant or a coffee before you go to work. What manages to make these something special? So I'm going to speak to Anushka, the owner of this one, Emma's Deli kiosk, and see if she can explain this to me. So this okay. is Anushka and she is, you are the owner of yeah. this Butchkin. That's not the pronounce, right pronunciation, is yeah. it? Could you pronounce it correctly for me? Bütchen. Bütchen. It's Bütchen, yeah. And in English, that kind of loosely translates to kiosk, right? Yeah. But it means right. a lot more than that for people in Cologne. Do you mind just kind of explaining to me what uh, Bütchen really are? Um, I think it's some kind of meeting point. So, yeah, it's, the kiosk is some kind of... Um, the people in the... It's township? Is sure, right? yeah, yeah. yeah. They come together and they talk and it's like, yeah, it's like a meeting point. And is that how they're still used? Do people use them like that? Yeah. <laughs> In here, it's like that. Do you think um, there's something special about this one? Oh, yes. So I live in this road, in the Leibold Street, and this is only 200 steps to get the newest papers. And therefore, I am every morning here, around this time, 9 o'clock, and uh, I take two newspapers from Germany and uh, this is the most nice hour when I read the newspaper and drink some tea or coffee. <laughs> this contact thing is uh, special for Cologne because um, in Cologne a lot of things work like this. It's like um, you have to know someone who knows someone that does, uh, he, he's doing something or it's like this is the way it's working in Cologne, I think. Yeah, and, and that's special, and I think that's why kiosks work in Cologne, or it, it, that's why it's so typical for Cologne, yeah? Yeah, lots of human interaction and... Yeah, and everything is because of relationships. In, in Cologne, it's like everything works with relationships. Yeah. And that's why kiosks are, yeah, it's a special oh. thing. I noticed you're selling, you know, wine and... You're selling some like more deli items. Is that? Yeah. Um, um, we choose to sell really good things like good coffee, good wine, um, good chocolate, and some uh, things like this. Not like normal kiosk stuff. It's yeah. We decided to do it in another way. I've noticed the kind of garden space outside. Is that something that's typical to um, Bruchkins? I can't pronounce it. <laughs> um, no, it's not. It's. Um, we did it this way and it's like guerrilla gardening, <laughs> some kind of this, uh, yeah. Yeah, because it's right in the middle of the city, right? And it's yeah, we just did it. It's not like, um, that's not our space or something, we just did it. And it's working and people use it. Yeah. 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 Lovely. I mean, really lovely. Thank you. <laughs>